How do we save more rivers? I honestly think it starts with love. You have to love a place before you're going to care about it and, and do something for it. And so I worry that, that more kids aren't having outdoor experiences that connect them to a place and, and make them fall in love with a place. You have to fall in love with a place if you're going to, if you're going to fight for it. I owe so much to rivers. It's just when you when you visit a river over a span of your life, it just becomes it's part of your life, and you can you can see your kids growing up there and see your own life rolling out before you. Uh, and so I I owe these places. I have to give back. Every American, everyone, should be able to drive to the end of the road and go hunting and fishing and paddling and camping and use that, use this land, this, this land that belongs to all of us, public land. What a concept. It belongs to every American. We have to protect it, we have to preserve it, otherwise it's just not gonna be there. And certainly now, as, as a mom, um, I've got two little boys, and I want my kids to experience these places. And I mean, everything, the, the water, the stars, the canyon, the, the long days where you have no idea what time it is, and you're just swimming, and it's just us. We're connecting, and what else is there? I mean, that's, that's the most important thing, just to be together.